Hey guys, I'm back with another Japanese product review. Last week I reviewed the Yuru Yuri Season 1 Premium Edition Blu-ray. It came with the art book and then the two discs and all that good stuff. Well, this week I figured I'd review or unbox, whatever you want to call it, Season 2 of Yuru Yuri Happy Go Lily Premium Edition. And really the only, in the Japanese you know, version of the name, the only difference between the names was these little musical notes down here. Other than that, it wasn't really called Season 2 like these Blu-rays are called. And again, it doesn't say Happy Go Lily in the Japanese version. It's just Yuru Yuri in the Japanese version. But in the English version, they decided to add Happy Go Lily for some reason. I don't know. So, let's check it out piece by piece. Okay, here we have the Yuta Yuri Happy Go Lily Season 2 Premium Edition. Again, I don't know if this is the front or if this is the front. There's just two big pictures with a logo on both sides. Bottom says Yuta Yuri Happy Go Lily. And top is all that good stuff. Left side, Happy Go Lily, same thing, Season 2 Premium Edition. This side has all this information. So 1080p, AVC, MPEG4, 16 by 9 aspect ratio, region A, how many discs are there? Two discs, sets total, well there's just two discs. Audio, linear PCM, 2.0, Japanese only, subtitles, English, non-removable. I went over this last time in my last video of the Season 1 Premium Edition, but you can remove the English subtitles if you just go into your Blu-ray player setting. PlayStation 3 has it, PlayStation 4 has it, Xbox One has it, many other Blu-ray players have it, and so just go into your subtitle settings. Sometimes even the remotes have a subtitle button, and then you can just click that. 12 episodes total, 286 minutes in color, teen 13 plus rating, and then all this, you know, stuff like that. NIS America is the company that, you know, licenses it or whatever. Anyways, let's, you know, take a look at the good stuff. Again, there's two discs, and this is, you know, just cardboard. Oh, and there's some... What is this? Oh yeah, it's more advertisement junk. I think, I think this was the exact same advertisement from the first season. I think they just sold both the seasons back to back. They didn't like wait a year or anything. Alright, so this, season two, disc two, season two, disc one. Again, they are very thin plastic cases. So first disc has the first 10 episodes and all with English names because of course they have the English subtitles and all that good stuff but still only Japanese audio. Here's the disc. Doesn't have the episode names on the disc but you know you have it on the case so that's good enough. Shut up. Season 2, disc 2. Two more episodes plus a clean opening and clean ending, which of course means there's no credits rolling, it's just the endings. So I figured I'd just show you guys the main menus. So this is the main menu for the very first disc. You have the option to play all the episodes, pick an individual episode, or play a few trailers from different anime. And of course you cannot select subtitles on or off or anything like that, you have to do it in your Blu-ray player settings. And this is the second disc's main menu. You can play all the episodes, choose an individual episode, or have extra bonus content. So as I said before, the extras have clean opening and clean ending, which doesn't have any credits. And the clean episode 11 prologue is just the beginning of the 11th episode because there wasn't an opening theme song on that episode. There's just a sequence of events with credits over them. So the clean version doesn't have any credits. So the B-side previews are just previews for the next episode at the end of each episode and then the video art book featurettes are pretty much like video art books really that's the best name for them. It has some art pieces that are available in the art book that comes with the premium edition but it also has a few clips from the first season and just a bunch of different stuff like that. This featurette is actually 11 and a half minutes long. Let's check out the art book for season two. Again, it's a hardcover. 
think in my last video I said offset of hardcover was softcover, but of course offset of hardcover is paperback. I don't know why I couldn't think of that name, but whatever. Alright. And this is the first page. Then we have episode guide. It has a little bit of information for each episode. Of course, that's why it's an episode guide. And continues for the next episodes. Bam, 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 and all that good stuff. Man, this show looks freaking awesome. Uh, if you guys haven't seen it, you guys have to see it. It's one of the funniest animes I've ever seen. You can watch any episode and just enjoy it. It doesn't really have a story or anything like that. Then we have character artwork. This is Akari. Our name is Akari, but they call her Akarin for kind of like a nickname. Sort of. A nickname she doesn't like. Well, there's a bunch of pages, so let's just kind of pop through them. I can get pages unstuck. Then we have Toshino Kyoko. The, the other girl, Akari, it's Akaza Akari, I believe. And Funami Yui. And then the younger. Oh, wait, no, this is her well behaved cousin, Mari. I thought that was a younger version because there was one episode where they. We're doing a flashback of their younger selves. Then Yoshikawa Chinatsu. Sugira Ayano with Ikeda Chitose. And then Amuro Sakurako. And Furutani Himawari. Then we have some rough sketches, different things throughout the episodes. Oh man, that episode where they do the dog clock and then the teacher was talking about that super sad story of when how she got into science and all that stuff. That was like the saddest moment ever. Ever. And then it quickly followed up by comedy. Because there's like hardly ever any sad moments in this anime. More sketches. Almost at the end. Good stuff. And as I said before, sometimes there's some kind of romance type things. And it might make some people feel uncomfortable since they're like in middle school and it's just all girls. But really, there's hardly any real romance. It's just, you know, comedy and good stuff. And then there's some, a little bit of perverted stuff right there. So actually, this season shows more of the characters' sisters. So there's more characters. But it doesn't get too complicated or complex with, you know, a bunch of deep, thoughtful character creation or whatever. It's just all good fun. And I actually reviewed this anime on my website, so I will leave a link in the description if you want to check out the written review. And that's it. And then we have cast, episode list, screenplay, storyboard, opening theme, ending theme, lyrics, music arrangement, all that good stuff. And one more thing. When I ordered the Blu-ray, I also received this, which is kind of like an armband, you know, and it has it's connected by Velcro. This basically translates into student council. 
So you'll see some of the student council people from the anime wearing this. And you just put it around your arm like that. And it's about 16 inches long. Has little serrated edges. Again, Velcro on the sides. And it's kind of purple or whatever. Underneath it, it says Yudi Yudi. And then it has all that, you know, company information. Seven Force Entertainment, all that good stuff, whatever. So yeah, that's about it. Hope you liked this video or appreciated it. If you did, you can give it a thumbs up. And if you want to buy this product, I will leave a link in the description to an Amazon listing. If you buy it through my link, I will get a small cut and it won't cost you anything extra. It just helps keep my website and my YouTube channel running and you know, so I can pay the bills basically. And again, if you want to see a written review of the anime itself, I will leave a link in the description for that that goes to my website and you can see my written review of the anime. And I guess that's it. If you want to see more videos like this, you can subscribe to my channel because I have Japanese product reviews. I do educational videos about Japanese words and I'm going to be doing vlogs soon. So subscribe if you want to see that all that good stuff and more will be coming in the future.